that got across the 30-yard line was Barrett Liebentritt. Ball's out. Ball's out. out. Purdue signaling that they have it. We'll wait for the officials. And it is Nebraska football. Emmett Johnson is the man at the top of the formation. Officials come in and stop the play from our referee, Ron Snodgrass. Going on the field was a fumble recovered by the receiving team. Plays under further review. So we'll go under the hoods and take another look to make sure that yes. possession was in Nebraska's hands. Ball ends up on top of this pile right there. You see Stevens grab it. And his knees are down with possession of the ball. To further review during the fumble, a Purdue player recovered the football. It is first down for Purdue. Tyrone Tracy, the backfield card, puts it on the ground, and here come the black shirts. Loss of five, his first pass caught. Flag comes in. Catch made by TJ Sheffield. Holding. Holding, offense, number zero, 10-yard penalty. That is going to be a delay. Well, a crowd that is expected to be over 80,000 again getting loud. Delay game. Offense, five-yard penalty, second down. Handed off, right side. Tracy near the 40-yard line, third and forever for Purdue. Card is going to run it. Very safe and conservative call brought down at the 32-yard line, which was the original line of scrimmage when the drive started. They go for it a ton. They're 5 of 16 on fourth down this year. Fourth and 11. Card back to pass. Card going deep. Incomplete. First down, Huskers. Harbour back to pass, swing it to the outside. Flag comes in late, catch made by Johnson. Gang tackled at around the 40-yard line. An extension of the running game there out to Emmett Johnson. Check on the penalty. Holding, offense, number 51, 10-yard penalty, first down. Harvard keeps to the outside, and he's driven out of bounds. Yanni Karloftis, the first to hit him out of bounds. Grant to the backfield. Harvard lofts it. Incomplete. He was looking for Jaden Doss. Cam Allen on the coverage. Coleman with a touchdown reception last week against Northwestern. Harvard to pass again. Pressure, down he goes. Kadron Jenkins, his first sack of the game. It's his eighth tackle for loss. Sheffield back to receive. And a very short kick into the wind. Takes a Nebraska bounce. And rolls out of bounds at the 37-yard line. Devin Mockaby had 178 yards rushing in this matchup a year ago. He's in the backfield. Card to throw it. Complete drop down good open field tackle by Phelan Sanford. He has been great filling in for the injured Deshaun Singleton. There goes Mockaby right side. Plenty of room to run near Ball's the out. yard line. Ball is out. Nebraska's got it. Bleaks is in the backfield. He's been a receiver now, a full-time running back. That's how the injury situation has gone for Nebraska. Leakes gets it, slithers his way across the 50. Second down and five. Gibb goes to Grant, he goes nowhere. There's Jenkins again, had a sack, and now a second tackle for loss. Yeah, Kendra Jenkins has shown his athleticism and his power. Now back on Nebraska's side of the field from the 48. Third and eight, Harburg flushed, able to keep his feet for now. And Purdue able to knock him down. It was Markevious Brown who was finally able to bring him down. Scorton got his first hand on it. Pin him deep 
Brian Buschini. Fair catch called for by TJ Sheffield. Tracy gets the handoff. Nice tackle across the 20 yard line out to the 23, gain of six. To pass to the outside, catch made, rolling out of bounds. Jaden Dixon Veal on the reception. First down, Boilermaker. Cards three for his first floor. Big hole up the middle. And brought down John Bullock in space with the tackle. Offensive line protecting Card well early. Initial hit in the backfield, good blocking. And then finally a stop made by Quinton Newsom. Tracy calling out the signals, the running back. Third and three, play clock winding down. Card's got it, bring it heat. Slant route caught. Dixon Veal picks up the first down for Purdue. Gain of five. Handoff goes to Downing. There's Bullock again in on the stop. Minimal gain on first down. Seventh play of this drive. First two first downs of the game picked up by Purdue. Inside and nearly intercepted. Boy, third and seven. Hutmaker on Hartwig right here. Zero on 53. Center on nose. It's a great matchup to watch all afternoon. Card trying to escape. Card still looking. And able to throw it out of bounds before he takes the sack. a sack. Punt. From Jack Ansel. The wind in his back. A lot of pressure able to get it away. Fair catch called for by Bullock and Donald. Ball is still popping around. And they're going to give it to Purdue. They're going to say that Purdue initially had the recovery before the ball popped out a second time. The ruling of the recovery by the kicking team is under further review. <laughs> Looks like we have a switch of the opening kickoff, in my opinion. From this initial look, Bullock, as you said, never had it. And then it squirts out. Not under control. We're going to just pop up back over the top. And right there, is it Newsom that comes in? After review, Nebraska recovered the loose ball. It's first down, Nebraska, at the 13-yard line. A pitcher's duel? Is this a pitcher's duel? It's definitely a pitcher's duel. Both defenses are pitching shutouts. Speaking of pitch, here's a pitch to the outside to Emmett Johnson. Dragged out of bounds after a big hit on the outside by Thieneman. Off to a good start. Hand off and brought down to the backfield. Doss goes in motion. Harburg back to pass the outside. Fleeks, he beat his man. He's to the outside, down the sideline. Thieneman runs him out of bounds across the 40-yard line. Give the Fleeks on the toss, and he is wrapped up in dropped by Nick Scorton. Second and 12. Harburg following Fleeks and a big hit after a gain of two. This is a quarterback lead play right here. Fleeks just forgot the lead. Bringing some pressure. Block nicely. Harburg to the outside. Catch made by Doss. Into Purdue territory. Down to the 40-yard line. Great pickup right here by Emmett Johnson. They said he's our best protector. As we're getting a little uh, Halloween greetings here on the sideline. There was a little bit of that in pregame warm-up. They were exchanging some pleasantries and the same thing here. Yeah, they sure were. It was the senior Cam Allen who came up and he and Doss were getting into it. Watch Johnson right here fit up. Carl Loftus, great job giving Harburg a nice pocket. Doss protect that ball, Purdue. Trying to rip it out. Fleeks has it on the outside with the convoy. Thieneman brought him down, but not before another first down for the Huskers. Fleeks is another speed guy, converted wide out. Now a full time. They said, hey, we look at this guy as a running back. And you see that crossover pedigree right here, just speed and space on the jet sweep. Nice job out in front by Anthony Grant, 23 with the lead block. 
16 yards on the gain, and that is going to end this first quarter in Lincoln. Pitch to Emmett Johnson, space to the outside, and a good tackle made. That's Kane again on the stop. In the red zone for the first time, Harburg is going to get sandwiched and brought down. Jenkins was first, then Scorton finished it. Here's your duo. Yeah, look, these guys are, gosh, these guys are fun to watch. Five and four, the edge players from Purdue, and they just vice Harburg. It's a quarterback run all the way. They're not buying this at all. It's a seven-man box. You see Karloff just run out with the motion, and they just have a little defensive end meeting at Harburg. Fedoni was the one who was trying to keep Jenkins away from getting into the middle of that and just whiffed on the block. Outside linebackers, edges, whatever you call them, these two dudes can play. Motion man is Ty Hahn. Harburg sprint right. That's Hahn who makes the catch, and it's a first down for Nebraska. Get it out to Jalen Lloyd who drops it. And it's an incomplete pass. 12th play of the drive coming up and whistles coming out and a timeout called by Purdue. They might be trying to time out Purdue, their first of the half. Trying to play with a little bit more freedom. And now a penalty flag comes in. There's no foul in the play. We had the ready for play not being given. No foul in the play. Second down. Get to Emmett Johnson. Bowls forward. Picks up four. Third down and six. They're three for three on third down on this drive. Harburg pulls it down. Harburg is short. May have picked up the first down. Yeah, he did. And this, this is what makes him special. 6'5", 220. He kind of blows the read here, I think, initially. Should hand that ball off. Tried to throw the little slider. And then this just makes it right. You be, to have the ability to be physical, run through Sanusi Kane, and setting up first and goal. Good tackle by Kane. It is first down. So first and goal from the one. Brown went low. Kane went high. Johnson in the backfield. 14th play of the drive. Harburg. Short. 15th play of the drive is the longest play in terms of plays. This one in the end zone. Touchdown. Fedoni from Harburg. Nebraska strikes first. Fourth touchdown of the year. Alvano puts it through. To the back of the end zone. Hudson Card and Purdue. They had a pretty good drive going on their last time that they possessed football. But Sheffield in motion. Card throws high. And incomplete intended for Sheffield. Deion Burks with just two targets so far, no catches. Outside, secure catch by the tight end, Garrett Miller. Changing the plays, four to go on the play clock, gotta get going. Just able to beat the play clock. Card to the outside, catch good. Finally get Burks involved out to the 40-yard line and a first down for the Boilermakers. Going deep. Card, middle of the field. It's intercepted. Tommy Hill with the pick. Still on his feet. Making Boilermakers miss. Another Nebraska takeaway is Tommy Hill with a pick. After the turnover. He's got a man. Harburg going deep. Caught. Touchdown, Huskers. Jalen Lloyd. An extra point up and good. Two turnovers 
for Purdue. Time leading to seven points. Chilly day. Feels like 22 degrees with that wind as Mockaby gets it over the right side. Just his second carry. Second down and nine. Trying to get this up tempo offense up to speed. Down by 14. Give up the middle. Mockaby powers his way near the 30 yard line. Showing quads at the bottom of the screen. Busted up and put Mockaby to the right of Hudson Card. Gonna throw it on third down. Tucks it, now throws. TJ Sheffield a spin and a first down. Reimer coming back to the lineup last week after the bye had missed two games. Card pulls it back, throw. Incomplete, he was looking for his tight end, Garrett Miller. It's a beautiful ball by Card. That was a laser. Laser right into this wind. Second and ten. Good blitz pick up. A little more air into this one, and Sheffield couldn't run it down. In the coverage was Omar Brown. Three of five on third down of the Boilermakers. Card down the middle. Incomplete. Gifford got his hands in there to knock it away from Andrew Sawinski. Ansel to kick it away, directional kick. Takes a Purdue bounce inside the 20 yard line. Settles in at the 14 yard line. Nebraska gets the football again. Numbers for Harburg so far today. This high powered rushing offense. It's been more about the passing game. Into the belly of Emmett Johnson, and he is gang tackled at the 15. Jeffrey Mba, the first one to knock him down. It has been a windy, windy road. Harburg using the speed down the sideline out across the 30-yard line and a first down for Nebraska. First set of downs for Nebraska. 23 yards on the ground for Harburg. The pass again, going deep. Incomplete, looking for Bullock, and here comes a flag. Markevious Brown was on the coverage on Bullock. Markevious Brown said, hey man, he grabbed me first. It's gonna be a ton of one-on-one -on -one battles on the perimeter, here it is. 84 on one, a little sluggo, a slant and go. Rip that right That's on through. That's interference. Defense, impeding. number one, 15 yard penalty. Automatic first down. Now, I will say if I'm a Purdue fan, earlier in the game, there might have been that same thing on my guy, Dion Burks. I think that was a grab and restriction of Bullock and, and the right call. We saw a little hand on the face mask from Bullock on Brown as well. A lot of hand fighting. It's been a physical game on the outside for some of these receivers and DBs. The key for the Nebraska fans when you were talking about Harburg's numbers, a zero in that interception column. Two last week on his first two possessions on offense. Running around to the outside. That's Lloyd, and he's wrapped up by Jenkins. Anthony Grant switching sides in the backfield next to Harburg. Harburg is dropped. Scorton, again, a tackle for loss. Third and 15, Harburg in trouble. Jenkins put the pressure on him. Harburg still in trouble, throws it out of bounds. Lives to see another drive. Jenkins again bringing the heat. Bushini to kick it away with the wind in his back. And a smart move there by Sheffield. The touchback. Give over the right side and just tripped up was Tyrone Tracy. That one had big gain written all over it. Gain of seven regardless. We're going fast, but we can show that inches, inches, wrong side of cleats and slipping. Card to the outside, finds Sheffield. 
So Purdue gets the ball coming out of halftime as well. Card, spin move, and somehow able to get positive yardage out of it in the first down. And a flag comes out late. It's like just a pile on maybe on card late. My guess here. That shows right there that they, they think Hudson Card is healthy to run a zone read type of play, a, a read option concept. The bye week really helped out Hudson yeah. Card finally starting to feel like himself. See if you can see anything here after. After the play, dead ball, personal yep. foul, late hit, defense, number four, 15 yard penalty, first down. And they get Reimer for 15 additional yards from the 48. Tracy reversing field, running into trouble. Phelan Sanford brought him down. And the drive going backwards for Purdue. Card slips to the outside, sure tackle. Princewell Umaniello who made his first collegiate start today. Card back to pass, running out of time, able to deliver a great catch made by Sheffield. And a timeout used by Purdue. And it's all gonna kick it. Oh. Well, there was so much wow. going on in that play. Sets up shot from the 23 yard line. The goal, three timeouts. Harvard keeps. Brought down across the 30 yard line. And here comes a flag. He's a runner here, but is this a, a helmet to helmet hit? Personal foul. Targeting with the crown of the helmet, defense number 21. The play will be under further review for the targeting foul. Wow, that is a big call right there on Kane. Still foul for targeting number 21 may remain in the game. Second down. And again, just as Dean said, you can see it right there. That's a great picture. The top of the helmet. It's a six. What we got to do a little geometry, either a three-inch radius or a six-inch diameter. The top of that helmet, and the officials and Dean both both agreed. Correct call. Nebraska, their first. This is a 30-second timeout. Hit it off to Emmett Johnson. He's getting close to a first down. Clock still winding under 30 seconds to go. I'm so high on the the Reese's peanut butter cups. It's that's also number one for me. Forever and always. Bit of honey, like a bit of honey. Oh yeah, sure. We're going to the wayback machine now. <laughs> it looks like Nebraska is going to take this one into the locker room. 14 to nothing is our score at the half. Into the wind. <laughs> Tyrone Tracy on the return. They've got something dialed up. Almost busting it across the 30 yard line. But they got to make plays down the field in the passing game. Mockaby's only had three carries in this game as Tracy goes up the middle across the 35 yard line. First time that Purdue has been shut out the first half. In 10 years, they get blown up here. Omar Brown with a big tackle. You see Reimer and Bullock in the A gap, a double A gap look. One bluffs, one comes. Press the middle and dropped right in his paws. Miller couldn't hang on. After that first down gain of seven, couldn't turn into anything else. Bullock, as it takes a Purdue bounce inside the 15 yard line, it'll settle in at the 12 yard line. Harburg with the option, takes it, brought down by Thieneman, balls oh. out. Looks like Purdue jumped on it. 
Who's got it at the bottom of the pile? Purdue does. There's Thieneman again, right in the middle of the defense for the Boilermakers. Cole Brevard on the recovery. Carr keeps across the 10 yard line. Card to the outside, he could plead. He was looking for Miller again. Third down and six. Phelan Sanford in coverage. They need the three yard line for a first down. Card to pass, card, time. Card flushed, brought down. Another sack, Jamari Butler. Free Hill, got it blocked. In stride. Here come the Huskers. Newsom, six. You'll see the pressure. They've had big time issues with this. Judy, it looked like, was the guy that got his hands on it and just a cherry hop. And what do you do when you're going out for a little Sunday jog? You do give your buddy a little high five, take it to the house. Tommy Hill, who had the interception earlier that led to the big play on offense. Leading the convoy, giving high fives for Newsom. Point after, up and good. Mishandled snap, created the low kick. Fair catch called for. Mockaby in the backfield. Mockaby gets it. He has been very quiet today. He's across the 30-yard line. Mockaby with just his fourth carry of the night. Got the snap across, gets a Burks, Burks sandwiched. He's gonna be short. Isaac Gifford again with a big hit. Another three and out, just six first downs allowed by this Husker defense. Fair catch called for and received inside the 20 yard line. Nebraska has done such a good job on the defensive side of things, holding their opponents in check. Harburg to the outside. They get it to Fleeks. Crunched out of bounds by Markevious Brown. Uh oh, I was an uh oh in Dr. Tom. I was, uh, <laughs> I saw what happened there on the sideline. Fleeks just late, frustrated in front of the official. Yeah, can't take a swipe to the helmet. Fleeks had a pretty good day today, too. A couple of catches, 24 yards. He's run the ball well. Yeah. This Purdue offense has mustered just 110 total yards. Harburg keeps, slips one, and then brought down. Guess who? Brown again on the stop, and right there to slip him up was Scorton. Third and 17. Pitch to the outside, a lot of green. Oh, what a hit. Kadron Jenkins laying the wood. Into the wind, Sheffield back to receive Bushini. His first touchback of the year earlier. Sheffield dropped as soon as he caught it. Give to the outside, Tracy. Slithers his way across near the 45 yard line. Give him the 44 gain of seven. Time to throw. Give again to Tracy. Flag is out, short of a first down at the 45-yard line. Yeah, not a lot of time to throw, and the, the low percentage downfield shots they've been taking, and the turnovers. Holding, Holding. offense, Holding. number 88, 10-yard penalty, second down. That is Omar Brown that is down on the Nebraska side. Second down, 13, Hudson Card. All kinds of time, slips to the outside. Tracy brought down at the 35-yard line. Gain of one. Henrich on the stop for Nebraska. Break three. 
Hard goes down the middle, incomplete. He was trying to get it to Dixon Veal. Kick away from Ansel. Bullock will let it bounce. Takes a good Purdue bounce. Almost down. Thieneman was right there. Harburg again. He's only attempted nine passes in this game. Six out of nine. The big one to Lloyd for the touchdown. Gain of five on first down for Anthony Grant. On the option. Grant gets the high pitch. Just to the 30-yard line. This will be close for first down yard. He'll give it to him. Such a young group of receivers today with the injury situation, too. Harburg to pass. Harburg looking middle. Flag comes out. Malachi Coleman got locked up with Botros Alessandro. That's their favorites. Defense, number 19. 15-yard penalty. Automatic first down. Is he the former UN Secretary General? Botros, Botros, Alessandro. <laughs> Give up the middle. That's a fullback. Janiron Bonner picks up two yards. Traditional eye formation. Harper met by Scorton again. Brought down to the line of scrimmage. Motorized, right. motorized cart. Oh. Harper Ooh. brought down. Ooh, big sack. Scorton in on the stop as well as Yanni Karloftis. Punt from Buscini. Fair catch called for. Going to roll. And Purdue jumps on it inside the 10-yard line. Card going deep. Brooks. Birch couldn't hang on. It was in his belly. Newsom on the coverage. Birch has just two catches for eight yards as Card keeps it. Out past the 10 yard line. Over the last five, flag is out. Deep ball. Burks incomplete. May have been a free play. Yeah, looked like a free play, and then this sideline was mad. Looked like that could have been defensive pass. Offside, defense number 11, five-yard penalty, results in a first down. So they get a first down. They haven't had many of them in this game. Handoff, Maccabi, left side, huge gain for Maccabi. Card back to pass, plenty of time. Card middle, catch made. Garrett Miller hangs on to that one. And he's had some easy ones. That was a hard one. He went down and got kind of behind him due to Card having to leave the pocket. Let's take a look. Nebraska arguing that he didn't catch this, but no doubt about that one. At the mesh point, Card still has it in his hands. Brought down Jamari Butler. Loss of four on the play. Card steps up. Taken down by his shoes. Playing behind a beat up offensive line against a hot defense. Handoff up the gut. That's Dylan Downing. And a flag comes in. At 12 on the field there. And did not get the substitute off. Coach Rule, that's the international symbol. Hey, man, you got a lot of sub. Illegal substitution. Defense, more than 11 players. Five-yard penalty, third down. Downing gets it, brought down at the 50-yard line. Should say Tracy got it. It's going to be the last play of the third quarter. for Purdue. Maccabee in the backfield. Maccabee gets it, trying to get the edge. He reached for it. Did he get it? 
Reimer was forcing him out. He said short, and they are. Harburg going to run it. Harburg, big gain on first down. Give him eight. Second and two. Harburg hands it off to Grant. And Grant picks up the first down after a gain of three. Right there, Scorton. Running down Heinrich from the backside. Got to get going with that play clock winding down and a timeout used by Matt Rule. It's kind of a conversation point all week long as Harburg on the play action pass, let it loose. Risky pass and to nowhere. It was intended for Jaden Doss. Crap shoot, right? Absolutely. Yeah, and, and Nebraska, the, probably the most favorable of those schedules right there, and they'll certainly look back as that was a nice play by Susie Coin, or sorry, Kane. Long of 47. He's got a big leg. Hold was good. Kick is up. Long enough and good enough. From 55, a career long from Tristan Albano. Short kick coming up to receive Tyrone Tracy. Flag coming in. Tracy still on his feet. Sanford on the stop as Tracy dragged out of bounds. Two flags on, on the field. Yeah, this is going to be a hold on Purdue. 29 in coverage for Nebraska just got tackled. And they drew three flags. Three flags, sorry, a short one. During the return, holding, receiving team number 11, 10 yard penalty, first down. 12 yard line first and 10. Card to pass. Underneath into the flat for Miller and gets out towards the 15 yard line. Much improved. That's a good catch by Miller. Up to the 20-yard line, third down and two. Card on the slant route. Burks on the catch. Nebraska saying incomplete. They're saying we can stop the run, we can run the ball, and we can officiate right there. There were about three of them that were signaling incomplete. Purdue trying to go fast. Everybody's seeing it up on the video board. And they're going to blow this thing dead. Matt Rule may have used the challenge. Call from our referee, Ron After Snodgrass. Review, it's an incomplete pass. It's fourth down at the 20 yard line. So fourth down and two, and Purdue will punt. They won't even go for it on fourth and two from their own 20 yard line. Ansel back to kick it away again. Turner in the neighborhood. Run it for almost 100 yards. Passed it for just over 100. Harburg back to pass. Good protection. Oh my! What a hit! There's Jenkins again. And now a flag comes in. Jenkins, hands up, can't believe it. Harburg is trying to direct traffic downfield. Purdue's been charged with a sideline warning. Second down. Yeah, that is a clean, big time, huge hit on the quarterback from Jenkins. You don't want to pull up and turn back and not see that guy coming. Ooh. Another TFL for Jenkins. He was trying to turn back to direct traffic downfield. He was looking up. He yeah. thought that they were going to call him for targeting there. Said just a sideline warning on Purdue after that big hit. So a loss of seven. Harburg to run it again. Falls out. falls out. Another fumble forced by Thieneman, who's got it at the bottom. Looked like the old lineman got back in on that. Couldn't see which one it was. The 
Ben Scott was flying all over the place. Scott's up and producing when they have it. It's a tenth loss fumble on the season as Tracy goes backwards. Gifford again. Gifford has had a whale of the game defensively. Loss of five. Card to pass. Card flushed out. Throws it out of bounds. It was Ty Robinson who was in his face. Three turnovers from your offense, and you're still pitching a shutout. Can't Card. Have said that. All kinds of time. Card looking for help. Uh -oh. Card down the middle. Caught. Touchdown. Jaden Dixon Veal with the score. Card looking left. Card backs out of the pocket. Needs a lot of help. A bullet to the edge. Knocked away. Tommy Hill knocked it away. And finally, they're able to pay that one off. Onside try, and Borkutcher on the hands team pulls it in. Sims hands it off to Grant. Grant met after a gain of four. Had the injury against Colorado late. Harvard showed a lot of signs, and four and one in his last five weeks for Harvard. Sims hands it off. Grant met at the 45-yard line. Kane on the stop. And did the ball come out again? I think that ball came out. They're calling him down. The ball came. We'll take a look. The ball definitely 100% came out, as you can see. Omanode celebrating. Watch 23 has the ball. Thieneman, shocker, he's on the scene. Looks like his right shoulder is down, and then the ball comes out. Taking a look right here. You just see that ball off of his frame. As soon as that ball gets off your body, you're at risk. Sims messed up the exchange, and then he is brought down. Thieneman, short of the first down. Able to get back. That will go crazy on the sideline that they didn't react and or snap the ball. <laughs> Got a jump. Kick is away. Yep. Side. Receiving team, number 32. Five-yard penalty, fourth down. Four out of eight on fourth down this year for the Huskers. Heavy personnel here. They have a tackle there. You see him shifting over. That's an extra O lineman. In motion. Sims brought down, ball is out. Jenkins going the other way. Touchdown, Purdue. Oh my goodness, what is happening in Lincoln? Card to pass, blitz coming. Right into the flat, two point conversion, good. That's Sawinski on the catch. No catches all season. He converts on the two-point conversion. Purdue lined up. Kick is down, goes to 10 yards. And Bullock able to lean on it and get another onside kick for Nebraska. I think they were preaching ball security on the sideline the last time they were over there. Emmett Johnson. On the 44, second down and six. Johnson to the 40-yard line. Another gain of four, third down and two. Up the middle, first down and more. Thieneman saved a touchdown. Coming up on four minutes. Harper hands it off and in the backfield yet again. There he is, Scorton. Carries minimal gain, and, and he was holding on to it with the football. <laughs> Absolutely, <laughs> backing into that with all. Give to Johnson. Johnson up ahead. Touchdown, Nebraska. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct. Defense number 13. His first of the half. 15-yard penalty and forced on the kickoff. Extra point, up and good. 
Kicking into the seats, give him a souvenir. Perfect. No big deal, take out some photographers yeah. instead. Trying to get to win number five. With Tracy on the ground, what a great block. And we're gonna get a flag down for that great block. Personal foul, illegal blindside block. Offense number 88. First and 21. Previous plays under further review for potential targeting. So, so the, the crackback block that falls into the defenseless player arena, so it's just shot to the head or neck area. After review, there is no foul for targeting. First down. Card back to pass. Card stays on his feet and then brought down <laughs> just as he crossed the 20 yard line. That could have been really ugly. Yeah, I, I thought he was going to strip from behind. Just got a little more awareness right there. You got to either pull the trigger behind the line of scrimmage or go. And he was in limbo, and with Ty Robbins chasing down, limbo is not a good position to be. No doubt about that. Robinson's a load. Card pushed up out of the pocket. Card running for his life. There's Robinson again. Zone coverage on the back end. Brought four. Card steps up. Card looking downfield, and it's incomplete. Fourth and 12. Card. Picked off again. Tommy Hill, his second pick of the ball game, and this one is on ice. Finish this one out. Harburg hands it off to Johnson. Johnson into the pile. Just weird stuff happening with ball handling. Exactly. I'm playing with fire offensively, special teams. Trevin Lubin, ton of three and twos on paper. Not where the game was played. Lubin again. That's a first down. And this baby's going to be over. Well, it's been a fun one. One more snap. Coach, happy birthday, by the way, on the last play of this ball game. Thank you, sir. Big number 50 for Mark Helfrich today. Nebraska comes away with a 31 to 14 victory. It's the first time since 2012 that they're holding an opponent under 100 yards and 100 passing yards in one game.